Alright guys, we're going to go over a dribble pull-up drill that's going to make you a better shooter off the bounce. Here's the setup. I got three cones, and every cone I'm going to come to a dribble pull-up stop. So I'm going to pick the ball up when I come to my stop, then reset and get to another one. So basically what we're working on is the timing of our dribble and the timing of our pickup. We're also working on coming to a clean inside foot, outside foot stop, and making sure that we're not skipping forward and keeping that separation. So as you can see, I'm going side jab and stepping across. When I step across, I have to take that dribble, and then when this foot hits to stop, that's my pickup time. The problem I see a lot, especially with youth players, is when they go jab and dribble, they immediately pick up on this first dribble set, then swing the foot over. The problem with that is that if I pick the ball up early, I cut off all my options, and the defender knows I have to pick the ball up and shoot. I want to delay my pickup as long as I can until that last foot hits because that's going to give me the ability to come to that stop and turn and go. So if I wanted to go here, stop, and keep going, I could. If I pick that ball up early, I have to come to that stop, I have to shoot, I have to pass. So we want to delay that pickup just to keep our options open. So I love this drill because it gives us multiple reps at stopping and then it gives us that final game rep. You can also add in exchanges behind our backs or really any stop you want. <laughs> 